going on the track walk here with Hudson for the Monster Cup. Hudson races the 50 class there today. Racing the 50 class and Hayden's doing some BMX today then racing the Futures Amateur the next few days after here. Hudson, just don't fall off that. You don't want to be falling off that. <laughs> Wait till the dirt bike goes off it. Someone stops them, they go... <laughs> Hey, you're eating it. <laughs> Tracks pretty much. Yeah, you race at 8 o'clock at night. I don't, I don't know if you know this, but this is one of my favorite parts of the day. We are talking KTM Junior Racing. Man, these guys have qualified throughout the country. It is a good run for these guys. Right now, in front of the world, and it's going to be a good night. Man, who do we have? We've got some familiar names because they've got, one of them's got a really, really good Not only uh, uh, do we have Hudson Deegan, but I'm the number one. That's going to be Brody Moss. He's from Glendale, Arizona. Hudson Deegan, he's the number two, Temecula, California. Maddox Moretz from Morganton, North Carolina, and Braxton Zentner from Yarbo, British Columbia, Canada. Zakaria Carmichael from Riverside, California. He's on that number five, and the number six is going to be Travis Johnsmeyer. He's from the great state of New York. And then we've got Darren Pine running the seven from North Fork, California. And man, these guys, we've got 10 minutes just like all the pros, the futures, the super minis. And I'm telling you, when they come by your section, you make sure you make some noise for these young KTM Junior Racers. Just over a minute, 35 seconds. So they've got about two full seconds separating our top two spots, dropping all the way down to number three. by Travis Johnsmeyer. Looks like the number two bike, Hudson Deegan. We've talked about him a bunch already. Took a bit of a spill here in the sand section. He's back up on the bike already, trying to get it started up. You can see him, see him feverishly kicking and now getting a little bit of assistance. Trying to see if they can get that bike running again so Hudson Deegan can continue here in their first practice pass. Meanwhile, taking over the top spot, the number one time is the number one bike, Brody Moss. One minute, 31 seconds. I noticed a couple of times that he did not try to lay it over when he's going over jumps. Like, yeah. it makes him go all bobbling. You're trying to have style when you go over jumps, and we're not worried about it. Uh, that's really good. He's out tracks to the sand section he crashed in and then I think it's harder than he th thinks it's gonna be I mean all the kids the top four or five kids actually race where Hudson doesn't really race <laughs> he just rides for fun so I think he's uh, realizing that some of those kids are fast because they actually take it serious but um, it's cool he's having fun I think it's really just about him getting the race today really and enjoying the day I can get to go out there and ride the track and be a part of you know the show so it's cool I think it's a good experience for him wait a minute behind this guy oh that's so awesome Adam asked me for a picture yeah oh I'm sorry right on man yeah. we're at Monster Cup uh, day one and it's features tomorrow, and we're gonna do features tomorrow. And yeah, what she said. <laughs> Heading in to the track. Hudson's got another practice. This time we need we need three seconds on the clock.
fun right he has fun whipping it so every jump he's getting loose you know that's like his thing I don't think he's too worried about the turns he just he's all about he's all about the jumps he's all about the style you know <laughs> I don't know if racing's his thing <laughs> He's showing him, man. I told him, give me those three seconds. He did. He found three seconds. <laughs> He's at a 130 now. He was a 135 the first practice. Found five seconds, dude. So if it comes into a straight takeout battle, or you're trying to straight like take each other out, I put my money on it. That was good, man. Those lines were better. You just gotta stay up. You can't tip over to throw away too much time. But the track's super fast. I think he gets beat in the sand sections, in the fast sections, so we'll see. See if he can pull off a miracle here tonight. <laughs>
that's a bad time for Darren Pine to wind up off his bike. And you can see how upset he was to take that bump. But meanwhile, Gage Dunham on the number eight bike. Leap. There's the checkered flag as it waves. And that means we have a winner, Gage Dunham. Hudson Deegan on the number two bike. Sixth place, the number one bike, Brody Moss. It was good, and I thought anything could happen. The kid that was leading fell on the last lap, which I know he was bumming. But uh, like I told Hudson, I'm like, we have a track in the front yard, and we have dirt bikes in the shop, so anytime you want to practice, it's there, you know? We'll see. I think it was fun. He didn't crash in the final, which was good. He crashed in both practices, so in the final he didn't fall, so that was good. I were done at Monster Cup. I got four uh, so close to get on the podium. Got new GoPros, got a goodie bag, and we got the futures tomorrow, and that's it.